The fourth chakra is called the heart chakra and it is represented by the color green. The heart chakra is located in the chest area, the heart area. It is represented by the lotus flower and has 12 petals. The heart chakra is associated with the element of air. Um, it is responsible for our immune system, our compassion, tenderness, unconditional love, balance and equilibrium, including rejection. When one is faced with um, a blocked heart chakra, they are an emotional wreck. They, or you are an emotional turbulence, you know, despair, you, you have resentment, um, dependency, you are bitter, you grief, anger, loneliness, self-centered, the list goes on, you lack commitment, um, you lack hope, um, you have trust issues, simply because anything that um, has to do with the heart um, is also influenced by the emotional state or the emotional being of a person and the illnesses are so associated <laughs> sorry with this chakra um it is the heart you know heart problems your asthma that is your breathing problems allergies lung um the breast you know um the upper the upper back shoulder problems and bronchitis conditions if you have any, speak. It doesn't mean when you suffer from um, breast cancer and when you start meditating the heart um, chakra, it will go. The diets you need to take, the things you need to do. So when you're open and honest with your healer, it makes things easy for everyone. Um, they get to um, prescribe um, treatments that are permitted for your condition um, instead of aggravating the situation you are in um, you'd rather speak and then we can find a way forward so normally the heart chakra is, is recommended for those who are going through um, a breakup um, who have experienced death you know who are under grief um, you know those those um, emotional problems that have to do with the heart and some people don't have the problems that other people have and they would ask questions like how do I know that my heart chakra is functioning well well when you're full of wisdom when you practice compassion um, your inner strength balance of male and female energies we will get into that as time goes on um your pure intentions you know in relationships in business relationships within family um you are a source of inspiration to 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 other people um you're divine man your vision the way you speak you know you touch people from the heart and you know the ability to travel through space and become you know invisible the mastery of, 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 of languages, you know, your contentment, selflessness, sincere, kind, truthful, the list goes on and on and on. And for this particular chakra, I would like to share with you three poses that you can incorporate in your meditation. And one being the eagle pose, and two, the cobra pose, and three, the fish pose. Please Google these poses and you can incorporate them in your meditation.